Hello everyone, my name is Luis Antonio Salcedo and today I'm going to be reacting to High School Musical The Musical The Series Episode 3 of Season 1. Uh, you can find this uh, web series on Mickey Mouse's favorite uh, favorite streaming service Disney Plus. Uh, three episodes of High School Musical The Musical The Series have been released so far. Uh, I really recommend you start watching this show if you're a fan of High School Musical. Uh, I believe uh, we get new episodes every Friday, so I'm already excited to see if next Friday we get a new one. Because next Friday is Thanksgiving week, so I'm not sure if we're going to get a new one or not. But yeah, I'm excited for the fourth episode, because this third episode was really good. So I'm going to tell you the tea. Okay, so uh, the episode 2 of High School Musical, the musical, the series, at the end of the second episode, uh, Gina stole Nini's phone and gave it to uh, EJ. So um, so now on this episode, uh, EJ, we see EJ with uh, Nini's phone and he, uh, he listens to a voicemail that uh, Ricky left for Nini. Uh, this voicemail, uh, Ricky kind of expresses his feelings for Nini Anyway, um, this makes uh, EJ really mad, and then um, EJ goes to uh, Ricky and kind of like tells him like to stop pretending to be Nini's boyfriend, that um, that and to stop like uh, leaving her. Uh, thirsty voicemails so of course this uh, makes uh, Ricky kind of mad but like Ricky's like really sweet like he doesn't get like that mad anyways uh, so I'm still team Ricky although um, I kind of uh, feel bad for EA because EA wants to apologize to Nini uh, about stealing uh, her her phone but he's just not really sure how to do it and in, um, Nini instead of finding out that EA had her phone by by EA himself like apologizing she finds out uh, with Ricky telling her like hey what did you share uh, with EA the voicemail um, that I that I left for you, like, next time I leave your voicemail, please don't share it, and she was like, what, like, uh, what voicemail, like, because she didn't, she hasn't heard the voicemail, that EA is the one that heard the voicemail that Ricky left for Nini, uh, so now that Ricky has told her that EA, um, ha, uh, has heard a voicemail that Ricky left for her, she's gonna realize, hey, so that means that EA is the guy that had my phone. So she's gonna get uh, mad uh, with EA about him stealing her phone, but she doesn't know that EA wants to apologize to her. So I kind of feel bad for EA, uh, but at the same time, I'm still team Ricky T. He's a really nice guy. Uh, and he shows that on this episode he he tried to make peace with EA and all that. So yeah, I think um Ricky um Nini are meant to be, but still like in in the inside I think uh, EA is a nice guy. And uh, I hope like he's still brave enough to apologize, even though probably on the next episode. We're gonna see a Nini that's gonna be really mad uh, at him because because she didn't got the chance to to hear it from from him first that that he had her phone like she, she now just find out thanks to Ricky telling her that that why did you share your the voicemail I left you with Ian <laughs> and. She doesn't know what my voice so of course she realizes like EA had my phone and that's why he had uh, the voicemail. 
Um, so yeah. Well, everyone, if you like this video, please get a thumb up. Um, this was a really good episode. I'm really curious about what's gonna happen on the next episode. Um, so yeah. Um, leave in the comment on the comments below. What do you think about this episode? Do you like it? Uh, what do you think is gonna happen on the next episode? Uh, well, everyone, see you guys next time. Bye.